Hi Theatre Mania, I'm Leanne Cope and I play Lise de Sam in An American in Paris and we are going to do a bit of a backstage tour, so do you want to come in? <laughs> um, be careful down the steps, they're a bit steep. So, this is the boys dressing room in here, Ensemble Boys, and up there is the stage. We'll go up there in a minute. Hey, here's Max. What's up? What's going on? <laughs> this is Theatre Mania. Give a tour. Yeah. Theatre Mania. <laughs> Welcome to the palace. I'm your host, Cope. <laughs> I do love living in a palace, I have to say. It's great. You know, when I came from England, I thought, oh, no royal family, but then I get to come to the palace every day, so that's great. <laughs> I can pretend to be the queen every day. Oh, do you want to come in? We can all go in together. So, go? you want to all try and squeeze in this lift? So, um, we can do it. There are a lot of stairs Isn't in this theatre. Are oh, you getting your pair of shoes? Custom oh, amazing. Yeah. Is this me? Oh, this is me. Fun. We're on level three. I'll just go be upstairs with my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is my dressing room. Jill, oh, Jill's here. Say hello. This is Theatre Mania. <laughs> We're next door neighbors, and this is my room, which. I've kind of gone a bit crazy with my room. I've never had my own bedroom. So it, I feel like I'm having my like teenage moment in here. It's just plastered with everything. Um, I have my picture of Leslie Caron just to inspire me every night. Just different things, point shoes. Um, down here, point shoes as well. Just hundreds of point shoes because as a ballet dancer, they are our tool. They're are the most important thing, they keep us literally on our toes. So um, you'll see a bit more about the point shoes later, but I'm going to get changed into some practice stuff now so I can go down and warm up for the show. I go through about three or four pairs of point shoes a week. So I now do seven shows a week and they don't last very long. They're made out of a kind of like paper mache. A lot of people think point shoes are made out of wood because they do this. I mean, I'll grab a pair. They sound like they're made out of wood. <laughs> um, a brand new pair looks like this. They're really, really hard. That's where they're brand new. Um, and to make them kind of mold to your feet, you want them to look like they're part of your body. You don't want to look like you have a pair of shoes on. You want them to just feel like your feet. So you break them in and mash them around to make them feel as comfortable as they, as that can possibly be. It's not very, it's never very comfortable, but you make them as comfortable as you can be. Yeah, so that's a brand new shoe. This is a shoe I'm hopefully going to wear tonight, which is also sounds pretty hard, but I will go downstairs before the show and bash them around a bit. So that's a ritual I do before most shows and that people know when I'm here because I'm there bashing away. But you'll see part of that when we go downstairs. <laughs> See, Robbie has the whole of Paris on his wall. Yeah, my wife did all cool. that during a show. And the picture from the Chatelet as well, which is lovely. Yeah. yeah. This was Judy Garland's dressing room, which I think is kind of cool, right? Yeah, though I think her ghost might be in my dressing room. I hear strange noises in there. Do you really? Yeah. I think she might be with me. <laughs> in the and shower, yeah. particularly. <laughs> I have to say, when Robbie's on stage, me, Max, and Brandon come down here and they steal his phone and take pictures on it. That's quite fun. You're have the one you who's taking the photos? Yes. Oh, what are you doing when I'm on stage by myself? What do you, you're with Jill. Oh, it's with Jill. <laughs> <laughs> so we normally just sit down there, they come and steal his phone, and we take pictures on it just so he finds them, what, a what, couple of days later? Yeah, and I'm like, Sometimes it's crass. It's <laughs> That's quite fun. We're going to head to the warm up room. It's where most people warm up before they show. A lot of the swings um, stay there during the show and they mark the whole show down there. They sing along, they dance along with us. There's a screen and everything. So um, that's just. Oh, oh, look who's warming up. It's Brandon. He doesn't dance one step in the show. He's the only one warming up. Actually, that's not true. He does dance in the show. He does some tap dancing. So um, this is this is the warm up area. Oh, this is this is Ashley. She has my wig in her hand. Mine and Jill's wig. So, hi. Oh, hi. This hello. is Theatre Mania. <laughs> and hello. This is Ashley, and this is this is 
Lise de Sand. <laughs> this is the wig and this is Milo Davenport. <laughs> and, and I think you definitely need to get a, a picture of a that. Picture of you and my butt. Yeah. <laughs> this is, um, just got to like warm up the muscles for the big ballet at the end. <laughs> yeah. For all those double tours that I do. It, it's all true. All the lifts that I do. It's true. I'm kidding, I don't dance. <laughs> he does, he does some tap dancing and he's bit. very good. But I limp, I have a limp and it hurts my body. Yeah. Thank you so much, Theatre Mania, for popping into the Palace Theatre. Um, I'm Lise Desan. He's Adam Hochberg. And we are in an American in Paris, and we really hope that you come and see us soon. Yeah. Au Ciao. revoir. Sorry. Au, Au revoir. revoir. <laughs> Remember, we're French. Well, I'm Whatever. French. I'm French. You're not. I'm not. No. So it's okay. You can say what well, you said. Ciao, though. That's. I know. Isn't that Italian? I don't know what it well, is. Well, okay. Bye. Au revoir. <laughs>